Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel Learn to become an animator. In this video I am going to show you about the wonderful thing which is very useful for the people who are using the reference for their animation in the Maya. So most of the animators are using the reference when they are doing the animation for the animal and the creature. So they require to load the image sequence or a MOE file as an image plane into the Maya to use that reference as an image plane. So sometimes it takes little time because of the namespace or path or adjusting the image plane etc. But recently I came across one wonderful tool that's called image plane loader. This tool helps very much to load the image plane into the Maya very easily. Let me show you. So you can see this is the tool. I'll put a link into the description about this tool so you can download it and install into your Maya. This tool is developed by Andy J. Latham. You can see here. So you just have to download it and install into the Maya. Put the shortcut button onto the self. So once you click on it, it appears like this so let me show you how it works once the box is open then you can directly without selecting anything you can directly create image plane let's check about that first you can see there are couple of options on the option box but we can directly just choose a video or image sequence without selecting any camera or anything like that. So I'm just clicking on this option and I'm loading the video. The camera has been created automatically and you can select that camera. This is the reference camera and you can just play. So the whole image sequence loaded as an image plane and it plays very well. So this tool basically does the create the image sequence out of the video and it loads into the camera let me show you when we created the image plane it created the image sequence as well this is very handy and very useful otherwise what we have to do is we have to create the image sequence sometime and then uh, we have to load into it so when this tool creates the image sequence it, it is also quite light you can see the image size is very light which is created by this tool. Let me show you one more option. Let me clear everything. I am going to also delete this image sequence which is created by the tool. Now let's create a camera. If you have the camera already in the scene, so we can select the camera, choose the video and load it so it's going to create the image plane connected to the our camera sometime you know we have to offset the image sequence or the image plane which have, have been created okay and it's uh, quite difficult by moving from this offset value for that this tool has a nice option called free image plane this also can be created from here pre image plane the same thing the tool is giving us the same option so let me take a new file and i'm going to create one more camera here now click on the free image plane option before that i'll just delete the previous image sequence now i am selecting the moe file again now you can see now go to camera a nice image plane has been created now directly you can click onto the image plane you can scale it let me switch on the gate mask and the resolution gate so we can easily understand so we can just select the image plane we can move the image plane anywhere into the camera and the very best thing is the image plane is always always been attached to the camera even though if we are moving the camera okay the image plane is still there and it's attached to the camera so it's a very very useful okay sometime if you feel this is also the very heavy so we have one more option into this tool 
देर इज अ फास्ट मोड ऑप्शन सो लेट मी क्रिएट कैमरा फॉर दैट एज वेल एंड आई एम गोइंग टू जस्ट डिलीट दिस सिक्वेंस selecting the camera select the fast mode and choosing the again the image sequence now you can see what tool edge does tool is doing that removing all the color information everything and create the image sequence very very light so it plays very real time without lagging very fast most of the time we don't require the color information for the animation purpose so this is also very useful option and the image size you can see it's very low is just 22 kb so this is how I've, i found this tool very very helpful or very easily you can create the image plane you can remove the image plane and we don't have to worry about the name space and it can be created and use very easy for the animation i hope this tool is going to be very helpful put your comments into the comment box and thank you very much see you soon with the one more exciting tutorial thank you if you like my tutorial you can subscribe and share thanks a lot